sweets I was never allowed as a child. Because when I was younger, my mum used to lock me in a pantry with only raisins and dry wheat bix Not letting me have any sweets made me into a sugar fiend when I was older. Oh, God, there was this guy at my school called Kevin. I remember one lunch break, we all dared him to snort some popping candy. First of all, he put it in his ear. Fair enough. And then we made him snort it. It was, like, funny for about a second until he was like, Ugh! and it's like, it's, like, popping up his nose. Yeah, what a dickhead. So, to make use of all my culinary skills, I'm going to make the ultimate feast I never had as a child. I'm going to have a popping candy pavlova and my fantasy alco pops. Popping candy pavlova. Popping candy pavlova. It's a really easy recipe. It's just whipped egg whites and sugar to make a meringue base. Then I'm going to sprinkle it with a buttload of newsagent sweeties. Mmm, phlegm. Feels like I'm cupping a very delicate testicle right now. <laughs> You're like a fucking huge marshmallow. <laughs> OK, so they're nice and fluffy, so you need to start dumping in the sugar. There's loads of it. You're going to add it gradually, but it is literally like a bag full of sugar. <laughs> I think if I'd been allowed sweets when I was little and just got it out of my system then and there, I'd probably have a much more refined palate, because everyone else my age started eating chorizo and liking olives and Guinness, like all the weird flavours, and I'm still eating, like, strawberry laces. The next step is to plop it onto a baking tray, just like a cow pack. Then you're going to put it into the oven for an hour on a low heat. <laughs> So your pavlova is cooked. You've had it out of the oven for a couple of hours, so it's nice and cool. So it's not going to melt your cream. I love spray cream. It gives me a sugar boner. Oh yeah. Put loads on. Don't be a pussy. Just put popping candy everywhere. Okay. Got the cream on. So now you've got to decorate it. I don't mind nice girly sweets like flumps, kind of pretty and pink, but boy sweets are so much better. All the characters on boy sweets look like they're on mescaline or something. Ah, oh, it's like a tongue deodorant. It's not that she's like anti sweets, my mum, but she just wanted to keep us calm because my brother was like fucking mental. He's always running into ongoing traffic. Whenever my dad gave me sweets, it was just really obnoxious. That's when I like discovered swearing as well. She could have given us Ritalin. I would have been much happy on Ritalin. Ah. <laughs> so now for the puberty portion of my dessert. When I was a teenager, I have to say, I was a bit of a late bloomer. So when everyone else was behind the park benches getting finger bangs, I was just on my own, downing snaps and playing with my Tamagotchi. And then you just finish off with the peach snaps. <laughs> have a swig of that. Mmm. Peachy. Now it's just got just enough room for a dollop of ice cream. There we go. Look at that. The perfect peaches and cream drink. So, there's my popping candy pavlova and my fancy Alco Pop float. This girl eats food. This girl eats food. This girl eats food.